Hello friends, welcome back to Romcart. Today in this video, I will show you how to flash a custom recovery and root Redmi Note 10 Pro and Pro Max. So keep watching this video till the end so that you don't miss any steps. And if you are new to my channel, make sure to subscribe to this channel. So let's get started. So the first requirement to do this is the bootloader of your device must be unlocked so if i click on miui version six to seven times it will say you are now a developer then if i go back and go to additional settings and developer options here you will find an option which is me unlock status so if you don't know how to unlock the bootloader of redmi note 10 pro and pro max then watch this video to unlock it right now and if you have a new me account you will be able to unlock instantly so after unlocking the bootloader make sure to set up your device and turn on the usb debugging it will show a warning and go back now the first thing i will do is flash a custom recovery so let me show you which custom recovery i am going to install so i have joined the group and channel of redmi note 10 pro and pro max so to search for the recoveries you have to go to the discussion group for redmi note 10 pro and pro max and here type notes and you will get the recoveries note so click on recoveries and type hashtag and then enter recoveries and you will get all the recoveries so if you click on twrp you will be redirected to this post but this is basically for android 11 and currently i am on miui 14 which is based on android 13 as you can see so i need to download the recovery for android 13 so i will search for recovery here so you can see we have the twrp 3.7 12 mod unofficial which is for android 12 13 and 14 and for recoveries i suggest the orange fox recovery for redmi note 10 pro and pro max so let's search for it so here you can see we have finally found an orange fox recovery post so in this post you can see we have orange fox recovery version r11.1.6 and this is for android 12 13 and 14 so what you can do is just click on download and it will redirect you to this github page and here you can see the orange box recovery post which is r11.16 here you will get three files the first one is basically the erops compression version which i don't know about and the rest two versions are one for miui and another is for custom roms so currently i am on miui so i will download the miui zip so click on download to start the download but I have the file already so you will need a PC or you can also do this from another Android device using Bugjagir app so let's flash the recovery first so for rebooting the device into fast boot mode what we can do just hold the power button and click on reboot and then hold the volume down button so when we hold the volume down button for few seconds after rebooting you can see the fast boot mode automatically turns on i mean the device reboots into the fast boot mode now we are good to go so in pc you must have the adb and fast boot drivers if you don't know what is adb and fast boot drivers you can watch this video about how to install adb and fast boot drivers in just few minutes so after that you will have a folder which is platform tools so from here i will flash the recovery so now we need a usb cable like this so i will connect it to my pc now in the address bar type cmd and you will get a command prompt window like this type fastboot devices and you can see my device is connected in fastboot mode now what i can do i will enter fastboot flash recovery so we have recently extracted the orange box recovery zip file so i will open that folder and we have the recovery image right here you can see it says disk image file we need basically this file so after fastboot flash recovery hit space and make sure there is a space otherwise it will not be flashed so after that just click on recovery image then double click and drag it to the command prompt window now after doing this just hit enter and the recovery file will be flashed in few seconds you can see now what to do enter fast boot reboot recovery and the device will restart and it will boot into orange fox recovery so let the recovery boot it will not take much time so here it is i will enter my lock screen password so the decryption is successful now i have access to the internal storage so by default the orange fox will not look like this i have basically customized it that's why it's looking like that to customize the orange fox theme you can go to settings and go to 
the customization and from themes you can customize by using any color scheme however let's stick to the topic so when you are on the recovery mode you must copy the zip file which is this one to the internal storage because there is some mandatory files that will be flashed when we flash this zip file so after flashing the image and booting into it i will install the zip file so i will click on the zip file and swipe to confirm flash so the recovery file is flashed and it automatically rebooted in 5 seconds. So the orange box recovery is now permanently installed on our Redmi Note 10 Pro and I will enter my screen lock again. So it will look like this. Now flashing recovery in our Redmi Note 10 Pro and or Pro Max is successful. Now the next step is to root our device. So to root our device what we can do is first option is flash magic or you can also go with the boot image method. So I will show the easy method which is by flashing the magis 27 apk and we don't need our pc and we can now disconnect the usb now to root our device i will flash the magis 27 apk so in the internal storage i have the magis 27 apk in my download folder so i can search like that or search for magis and you can see i have the magis 27 apk so i will click on magis 27 app and simply flash it so you can see it's basically launched the magis 27 installer so yes the magis 27 is successfully flashed on our device now we can simply do reboot system even without root you will be able to use the orange box recovery permanently and it's not like realme where we have to root our device to permanently use a custom recovery in this case orange fox you can simply use it even if you don't have root so my phone has rebooted and now an unknown apk will pop up just like other magic versions or you can simply go to file manager and search for the apk so we have the magic 27 apk i will click on it and click update and we can see the magic app right here so routing our device is now complete now i am going to show you how to do the safety net and all stuff so for that i have to open the magic cap so after opening the magic cap it will say requires additional setup so click on ok and click on direct install and click let's go and it will do the steps like patching it and flashing the boot image etc now click on reboot and after magic 26 we have to reboot two times basically otherwise full magic installation is not done and guys if you know about the kernel issue i basically could not find any kernel that is made for me ui and also supports the kernel issue i, I am showing the method to root with magic so guys after rebooting the phone just open the magic app and here you can see it says magic is installed and the ram disk is yes now for proper magic hide and use the gyrisk you need to go to settings and turn on gyrisk and then flash safety net modules and all that you will get in the safety net video so if you want to do proper magic hide and use the payment apps watch the safety net video that i made and also for magic 27 proper installation i have also made a video so you can also check that out so again if you are new to my channel make sure to subscribe to this channel and if you like this video make sure to give it a thumbs up i will see you in the next video